Cockpit kill! Cockpit kill! Hi friends and welcome back to German Engineering. I'm your host TTB today with the Jäger Mac Duelist and we're going to be running this thing in its special move loadout, the double heavy gauss arm mounted Jäger Mac. Let's go! Why oh, hello there Mr. Sparky. Boom and gone. Perfect. That's what I want to see. Come on, really ugly head again. Another hit. Bring me an Azir. Target spotted. Oh, hey, invisible wall. Nice to meet you. That's a whiff. Now we're talking about range, this is better. Getting into close encounters here. Why are you looking at me? That is a side trusser. Teammate did his best to shield him, but I was faster. Thankfully, I was faster. Yep, I earned the side trusser. Yoink! Oh, I just hit. I have no idea what I just hit, I hit something. Some prayer lord! He's coming! Goodbye. Dude, why are they all halved? Can't pop a UV here. Why not? Well, it's a good thing I didn't push here. It's an assault mech lurking. Ow. Where are my teammates? Ah, respectful distancing behind me. Okay. Timby is one shot both CTs. Good to know. Maybe we just sneak in and do that. Let's do the deed. That's a Sparky. That's one side throw, so that's the other. Well played, teammate. Good shot, my good sir. Oh, I tried to get it through the spot right there, but it wasn't possible. But we were just gonna be behind them then. Oh, yeah, he's also toast. Yoink! That's a hit. Now we say hello to the Mad Cat. Take off his side thruster so he can't shoot us back. Yoink! The yoinking will continue! Uh, what? Excuse me, sorry. Ah! I was weirded out for a second. Target 
How's it going? Ha! Did you guys? So I almost died, but not to enemy fire. I died to not so friendly fire. <laughs> that was a good round in the duelist. That was fun. There we go. That's the match I wanted. Four kills, two two KMDs, 950 done, 250 taken, 18 components destroyed, and the UV kill. Nice. 649 match score. And we sacrificed Jerry, so everything's okay. The sacrificial Jerry always gives us good match score. GG. The fact that you can't move your arms like this is a problem for this mech. You're basically a fixed turret. I also find it funny that the ammo has so far has never been the problem. I've never gotten through more than half my ammo, so maybe I can drop the half ton of ammo and see if we can get a little bit more, a little bit more speed. We'll see. Damn it, that pretty baby is going fast. That man's got the overdrive. Jump jets? This mech can't run jump jets, unfortunately. The only meters is my range, right? So... Oh, this is... Not in range. I still should have done 30 damage. I did more damage to him than he did to me, but still. What are we going to do here? The answer is nothing with this guy up top sniping. Right now I'm on tree destruction detail. Okay. Yeah, we won't be doing anything. Target spotted. Target spotted. Target spotted. And we go back. New target acquired. Target spotted. Okay, I got some of large exposes over there. That's a longbow. That's the next tag user. Interesting target focus. Target acquired. Target spotted. Target spotted. New target acquired. Target spotted. What's that thing? Target spotted. 
ein Onyx. Das Ring ab der FS Hexen. Man ist ein Fresh Atlas, okay. Who just focuses on me, of course, nobody else. Alright. the arm I think. There we go. Oh, it's in the 62? Holy shit. Ooh. Feels like we've been in this match for a while. Centurion. Again, damn that boy is running. Rip. Man, he's still up there sniping, of course. <laughs> Why am I not surprised? <laughs> There's two guys up there sniping. Alright. That's a duck I was eating earlier. Well. No. Oh, that wolf doesn't look so hot. Funny thing is the awesome is still up and kicking. That's kind of nice. Finally a hit. And of course we know who it is. <laughs> this is funny, just read the nickname and you know he's gonna be the last guy alive. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. And he's dead. There we go. Interesting match. Missed a couple of shots though, unfortunately. Could have had that Akti Cheetah if I... Aimed a little bit further ahead. Three kills, two solo kills, 500 damage done, eight components. And the Yumi kill. Not too shabby. Like I said, you're not gonna see incre insane high damage numbers with this mech. If you get like into the 500s to 700s, you'll have, a have, you'll have had a good match. The only way you ever get over 700 is if you are fighting a brawling match, which of course this was not. GG. Well, I'd say that is an interesting mech for sure. Here we have the build on screen, guys. As you can see, it is super Spartan. We are running an XL engine 225. You have to XL this, otherwise you will not get uh, around anywhere. You'll basically be a turret. So XL 225 for a 56 kph. We've got our double heavy Gauss rifles. Also, guys, keep in mind, while these are arm mounts, you only have shoulder actuators, but no arm actuators or anything like that. So you will not be able to move your heavy gauss rifles apart from the torso. So you can unlock your arms and you're going to get faster turning speeds of your torso, faster aiming speeds, of course, and smoother aiming, but you will effectively be torso aiming all the time. Keep that in mind. We've got three tons of heavy gauss ammo, but on top of the eight shots that we get per ton, we get an extra 16 shots thanks to our quirks and one sanity sink to make this thing complete. Plus, we shave the legs a little bit and we shave the head a little bit to accommodate all our ammo. Now then, we look at the uh, quirks of this mech. We get 15% ballistic cooldown, 10% range, 
20% in a sphere heavy gauss range and 10% velocity, plus of course the heavy gauss ammo capacity and some extra armor on the arms as well as structure on the rest of the mech. So our heavy gauss rifle is going to have a range optimally of about 320 meters. So realistically speaking, anything at 500 meters or so, just heavy gauss away and you will be happy. And you have enough ammo that you can just keep shooting this thing uh, whenever you have the chance to do so. So don't worry about that. Within the optimal range, you are going to do 50 damage with your two heavy gauss together. So that makes this thing a really nice cockpit cracker. This is about the uh, lowest you can go to sensibly run two heavy gauss rifles on the inner sphere side. Um, and um, there's not many mechs out there that, that do run double heavy gauss. You can do it, for example, on a Cyclops. You can do it on a Victor. You can do it, of course, on a Fafnir. But all these mechs are assault mechs. This is a lower end heavy mech. And um, so, yeah, it is limited, but um, it can run double heavy gauss. And that makes it kind of unique and kind of fun. So try it out. Also, you're an XL Jäger mech and you're kind of slow, so stick around teammates. You want to try and not be alone in this mech. You're definitely a frontline mech. You are a second line mech. You're shooting pinpoint at targets. Try to take them down as quickly as possible. But you're not there to soak up all the damage. That is assault mech or heavier, medium, uh, heavier, heavy mech territory. But not yours. You're an XL Jäger mech. Stay back as much as possible. Don't get stuck in trades with like big laser vomit boats or whatever, you're just gonna lose. So keep that in mind. Try to build guys, let me know how it goes for you. That's definitely a weird one. I would say it's not the strongest Jäger mech, but definitely one of the most fun to try out and play because it's just so unique. Thank you so much to all my beautiful supporters, guys. I couldn't do this without you. If you want to say thank you for the videos and become a supporter as well, then check out the various links in the video description. For example, the link to my Patreon, the link to my merch store where you can get yourself something nice. Or, of course, you can become a channel member or send a super thanks right here on YouTube. Whatever you decide to do, thank you very much.